Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to do a helicopter cartwheel as an example of what it is. I feel like most of these are difficult to explain. It's easier to show, but I'm going to be showing you step by step how to do a helicopter cartwheel. So let's get on with the video. There are two different ways to do a helicopter walkover. One of them is through a front walkover, so of course you need to learn how to do a front walkover first. Now let's break it down. You can practice by swinging your leg around in a circle, just like this. Now if you are a righty, so if you go through your right split when doing a front walkover, here you're going to have to bring up the opposite leg, so for me that would be my right leg instead of my left leg going up first. You can also try doing this with a little kick as if you were going into the front walkover. If you are still confused, I'm going to try and simplify by showing it to you in a shoulder stand. So basically, you're going to go into a shoulder stand and swing your right leg around. Also start with both feet down, first bringing up your right leg and then circling up and around while the other leg follows. It will be easier if you already know how to do this on your elbows. So if you want, you can first try it on your elbows like I'm showing here. Now as you can see my leg isn't really going down and around, instead it's kind of staying parallel to the floor. That's probably how it will look like for most of you, but if you have a really good balance in your handstand, then I think you can actually swing your leg down and up again. However, another way of doing it is once you do get up into the elbow stand or handstand, you're going to have one leg go around and the other just go up and over. Then you can try this on your hands instead of on your elbows. This can be confusing at first and take some coordination, so just keep on trying and repeating it over and over again. Another way of doing this is through a cartwheel. First, of course, you need to be able to do a cartwheel. Again, if you are doing this on your right side with your left leg going up first, you're going to have to switch it up and do the cartwheel the other way. Starting in the cartwheel position, put your hands on the floor, try pushing off with one leg and having the other leg circle around. In both of these versions, you have to push yourself forward, so pulling your weight forward instead of backwards. So make sure to give a good push off when you go into this helicopter walkover. As for your hands, when you're doing this from a cartwheel, you can be slightly sideways when you're doing uh, the front walkover. But if you want, you can move your left hand over to the front so that you can easily get into the front walkover. all for today's video i hope that you enjoyed it if you did then please be sure to give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this remember if you don't manage to do this on your first try it's totally normal keep trying and i'm sure you're going to manage when i first tried to learn this it took me quite a while I managed to learn it in a day but it took me quite a while to learn it so don't get discouraged if you don't manage at first. Actually, when I was filming the acrobatic elements video and I did that helicopter cartwheel in the video, I had to teach myself how to do it again because I kind of forgot. But that time I got it quicker because I know that I've done it before. So it might take a while to learn, but take a break and try again, try again the next day, and I'm sure you'll manage. That is all, and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Great, let's go, let's move it, move it. I like to move the boom. Two, two, three, six, seven, eight. It's a little bit weird. It's a little bit weird. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hi, guys. Oh, literally, as soon as I decide to start.
sih? it was out of focus focus please <laughs> please be in focus oh. 